Can I come in? Yeah, sure. Sorry about what happened back there. Hmm. You said no, I should have just left it. I still shouldn't have snapped. No worries. I'm making coffee if you want one. Not if it compromises your professional integrity, though, of course. I asked for that, didn't I? <laughs> coffee would be nice. Take a seat. I'm sorry if I've made things difficult for you. I'm sorry if I overreacted. All the rules and regulations we have to follow, it's tricky getting the right balance. Yeah, at least we won't have to worry about it for much longer. That's the main reason I'm here, Sophie. Look, there's no easy way to say this. <laughs> What, are you going to do, bail on me again? I'm transferring your care to another physiotherapist. Why? Because they asked you if you wanted a drink. We both know it's more complicated than that. Do we? In the time I've been seeing you, we've got too close, which is my fault. I should never have allowed it to happen. Too close? I think you know what I mean. Certain boundaries have been crossed. You're going on like we've been having an affair or something. No, but I'm not comfortable with how things are between us. I don't think it's appropriate to carry on seeing each other. Did do you know that I fancied you? I can't deny that's been an added complication. And you don't feel the same? I'm sorry, I must have misread the signals. I just thought you did. My feelings are irrelevant. Who are you kidding? Jenny, you want this as much as me. Sofa? What's going on? You've got to be kidding me. Look, Kevin, I don't know what you thought you saw. Don't what insult what... me, intelligence. He was kissing each other. Daddy, it's not Jenna's fault. Get out. No! No, Jenny, you can't go. We can't. We have you to stay put. Out. Dad! Stay put, this needs sorting you out. Plus kissed her, not the other way round. Look, she's supposed to be helping you. How could, how could she take advantage like this? Dad, I have just told you I made the first move. Her uh, age, she should know better. Age is just a number. Look, people in professions like hers, they have these strict rules. Rules to make sure nothing like this happens. You hypocrite. You weren't thinking about these rules when you thought she was up for it. Anyway, Dad, Jenna has done nothing wrong. We can't help it that we really like each other. You're vulnerable, Sophie. You've been through a terrible time. Yeah, I know, but I'm better now. Look, we thought you'd never walk again. A young lady like you, facing a lifetime in a wheelchair. Yeah, you're making a recovery now, but the accident and everything, it's, it's a massive shock to your system. Look, I know you're upset, but I'm an adult now, Dad. And none of this is really any of your business. I'm your dad. I'm looking out for you. Yeah, and you remember what happened last time you got involved in my love life? <sighs> this is completely different, and you know it is. Dad, I am telling you, stay out of it. <laughs>